from the first time that I saw particle physics, somehow it just felt right. Right now what uh, excites me the most is what's going on at CERN. It's really a special time right now. The particle, basically, that's been in many of the motivations behind what we're doing is this last one that's missing from the standard model, the Higgs boson. It's a historic milestone today, but we are only at the beginning. Now a lot of work is ahead of us, and I think also it has global implications for the future, and it comes at the right time, and I think we can be very, very optimistic. Thank you. We have finally discovered the Higgs, so it seems so. Quite exciting and looking forward to see if it's really the Higgs <laughs> or any person. <laughs> or anyway, I mean, it's a, it's a great, great achievement. Well, it's very exciting to see this uh, clear signal. Or, yeah, and now it's um, an interesting question to see what it implies, what kind of fix it is. But I am confident that there is something. It changes nothing in the lives of human beings on this planet. And if it's uh, standard model-like, it actually changes almost nothing in the lives of even people in pursuit of fundamental, uh, deeper understanding of nature, because we are thirsting for new physics beyond the standard model. So this is the second part of my answer, is that as an experimentalist especially, we would like to find things which have not been predicted by theorists, because that's where we would find the most excitement to understand things even better, and it progresses step by step all of this. So that's it for Higgs Day here at Dundam. It's kind of been one of those historic days in particle physics that we've been waiting for, for something like 40 years. And as for the question of how well we explained it to people, we'll have to take a look at the headlines of the newspapers and see whether we really managed to communicate effectively what it is we have been measuring, what we think we see, and really what we're going to be doing next.